Hi guys, I have a very good news for every one of you. We are going to start a new series on Python Pandas data science and automation. In this video, we are going to talk about the journey of Python Pandas. So guys, I am sure some of you hear about the Python Pandas and how it is very powerful for data operations. Guys, data analysis, time series, and data automation play a very important role for data scientists and data analysts. So guys, Pandas is an open source library that enables you to perform data analysis, data modeling workflows, data automation, any kind of automation you can perform with the help of Pandas. And also you can perform data manipulation, data cleaning, data extraction, time series, and statistical operation, etc. right? So guys, before begin this journey, you should have some Python programming concept knowledge, which we have covered in this playlist in greater details. Okay, so I will give you this particular playlist link in description, fine. And guys, really Pandas will gives you the great performance on the data set. And it is most usable library for data scientists and data analysts. And guys, data scientists and analysts often favor Pandas because it's less them work efficiently with larger amount of data, fine. And you know, Python Pandas has many high performance built-in function, which enables you to much productive and efficient on data. And really Python Pandas is the easiest and most intuitive Python package for dealing and handling the data, right? So guys, now in order to use Pandas, we need to import Python's Pandas library, okay? So how we can do that? So let's go to the Jupyter Notebook. Simply we can write here, import pandas and here i'm going to define our alias name which is pd fine so guys now to use any function or method of pandas which are available simply you can write pd and whatever the function name you want to use okay so guys first of all let me tell you what we can do with the help of pandas using a statement so simple pd and question mark so guys, now you can read the docker string, what does pandas? So let me expand. So here you can read the docker string. So here pandas is a Python package providing fast, flexible and expressive data structure designed to make working with relational and labeled data, right? And it is very suitable for real world data analysis in Python. And of course, it is the most powerful and flexible open source data analysis and manipulation tools which is available in Python programming language. And here you can read the main features. So it is easy handling of missing data in floating point as well as non floating point. Okay, so guys, it's provide the mutable data structure. It means columns can be inserted and deleted from the data frame. And here powerful flexible group of functionalities to perform a split, apply, combine operation on data set and both aggregating and transforming data, right? And it is very intuitive merging and joining data set, flexible reshaping and pivoting of data set. Okay. So with the help of pandas, you can read the files from CSV, delimited Excel files, database files, and JSON data and other kind of stuff. And of course, with the help of pandas, we can do time series analysis and other statistics operation as well. Okay. So guys, Python pandas is provide lots of features, right? Now let me show you the all the function or properties which are available within the pandas. So simple print, dir and pd. So guys, these are the methods and function of the pandas. Now let's take an example, how we can check the version of pandas. So simple, we can write here pd dot show version. So guys, this line shows me not only the version details of Python pandas, but it shows me the version of the dependency for pandas. And you can read this particular information. I'm using Python 3.8.5 operating system windows 10. Okay. And this is my machine name and what processor I'm using right now. And this is the pandas version and other supportable library version as well. Right. In case you want to extract only the version simple, you can write here pd and you can use a special method which is version so as of now we are using 1.1.3 versions okay and let me show you the another command which is pip show pandas so guys using pip show pandas we can have lots of information about that particular module so the module name which is pandas and this is the version and this is the one line summary which is powerful data structure for data analysis 
time series and statistics. And this is the official wrap page for the pandas. Author is none and some other information you can find here. And this is the location where I have installed the pandas in my machine. So guys, in the pandas journey, we will explore the most fundamental aspects of pandas to make your work easier and efficient. With the help of pandas, you can enhance the power of data manipulation and other aspects of data. And guys, during this journey, we will be use some other useful packages with pandas. Then you will see how we can play the important role in data industry. So guys, I'm very interested for this series and I'm using pandas from a long time in data world. In this series, I will be used extensively to explain how you can use pandas to enhance your workflows and day-to-day -day tasks. And guys, really, you will enjoy when you will use pandas for n number of things on data. And I want to convey my entire knowledge and enthusiasm to you. So guys, this is all about the pandas and what we can do with the help of pandas. So I hope you understood the basic concept of pandas. So guys, please stay tuned with us and I will see you soon. Meanwhile, keep learning, keep practicing.